Did you know that the White House press secretary is being banned for life at a farm in Pennsylvania? No. Why? In his defense of President Obama, Press Secretary Jay Carney is beginning to sound a lot like Ronald Zeigler, Richard Nixon's spokesman. And to some people, he is sounding like Baghdad Bob. Carney uses the word inoperative, as Ziegler did when incriminating evidence surfaced that proved his previous statements untrue. Carney also held a secret briefing on Benghazi for a select number of White House reporters, raising the ire of reporters not allowed in the room. A. Made a Pennsylvania farmer decide to begin blocking M.R. Carney from shopping at his tree farm. The farmer hopes more companies will follow his lead in banning M.R. Carney. Disclosure of emails that showing the White House was more deeply involved in revising talking points about the attack than officials have previously acknowledged led the farmer. The farmer to decide that he should not allow M.R. Carney to shop at his farm. The farmer sells arborvitae used to hide and block properties and the farmer feels that he does not want to sell any arborvitae that might help M.R. Carney hide from the public. The recent emails, which the administration turned over to Congress, show the White House coordinating an intensive process with the State Department, the CIA, the FBI and other agencies to obtain the final version of the talking points, used by Ambassador Susan Rice. The ambassador to the United Nations, in television appearances after the attack. She used these lies to hide the truth about the Benghazi attack from the public. It is evident the State Department, in particular, pushed to remove references to Al-Qaeda and Ansar al-Sharia, the Libyan militant group suspected of carrying out the attack as well as warnings about other potential terrorist threats from CIA, which drafted the initial talking points that M.R. Carney helped defend. Mr. Carney officials has stuck to his contention that the only wording change the White House made was to change the description of the Benghazi annex from a consulate to a diplomatic post. Indeed, the emails do not reveal major new details about the attack or other discrepancies in the administration's evolving account of it. Carney thinks that this is an effort to accuse the administration of hiding something they did not hide only this thinking makes the scandal worse. Carney's view of what actions were taken or what that individual did is not enough for him to say something concretely happened that was inappropriate. What a spin master. Mr. Carney for his assistance in lying to the public has brought on the span by Highland Hill Farm of Pennsylvania. Help support the span and join Highland Hill Farm in banning Jay Carney.